How's it going everybody? My name is Warner Fields with Fields of Profit. I'm a six-figure Amazon seller and full-time student and in today's video I'm going to be diving into how you can get ungated in health and beauty category. Um, this is a category that I got a lot of requests for um, trying to get ungated. Uh, I made a video talking about what I sell and I was actually able to sell about $12,000 worth of products in this category. So there's definitely big opportunity if you're able to get ungated in health and beauty. Um, so I'm going to be showing you a really simple method. I think it'll cost something like $80 or $90 to get ungated in health and beauty. Uh, if you did enough digging on the site I'll show you, you could probably get it cheaper than that. But I'm going to show you the products that you could use. So you could literally just go copy these exact products, um, copy this exact method I'll show you, um, and you'd be ungated in health and beauty. Uh, before we jump into the content if you could press subscribe I'm gonna be helping out your business if you could help mine out and subscribe that'd be great let's jump into it so the website we're gonna be using to ungate this category is called frontier co-op if you don't already have an account I'll show you real quick how to make that account if you have an account you can skip ahead a little bit in the video um, to go ahead and make an account you're gonna press join us on the home page up here um, just a side note make sure you're on wholesale.frontiercoop.com because they have a direct to consumer website we want to make sure we're on the wholesale website um, but from here we're gonna go ahead and press join us and then you're going to go ahead and select this um, this ten time this ten dollar fee. Um, it's usually worth it if you do one or two orders. Um, to it saves you money in the long run. So I would suggest getting the ten dollar fee. Um, but you can do this if you think you're never going to spend more than a hundred dollars on Frontier. Then do it. But otherwise, it breaks even if you do this. Um, so we're going to go to this membership account, and then you're just going to go ahead and fill out this um, information here. Uh, you would say that you're a web retailer. Um, you can use if you have an EIN, you can use that. Um, but you, you can also just use your social security number. Um, if you are a sole proprietor, you're going to have to do that. Um, you're going to fill out your address, billing address, all that good stuff. Um, make an account. Um, and then pay that ten dollar fee um, and I don't think you have to have a reseller certificate uh, that might have changed a while back um, it's been a while since I've made an account but it's not looking like it's asking for a reseller certificate and it's also letting you use a social security number which is nice um, so you can just go ahead and make an account and then we'll go ahead and jump into the actual products that we found to ungate this category so I have two products already picked out, um, but just in case those products are out of stock or something when you're watching this video, I want to go ahead and show you the method that I would use to go ahead and get ungated, um, just so this is kind of a guide and not just like a holding your hand kind of thing. Um, so you're going to go to beauty on categories, and I would suggest going to facial care, but probably any of these work. Um, I just thought that facial care might be a good route, and then the two products I'm going to show you are facial care products. Um, so you're going to wait for this to load. And then once it does, you're just going to um, try to find these products on Amazon. Um, if you want to, you can kind of find the cheaper products. Like I probably wouldn't use this product um, because the products that you're selling from Frontier, you're probably going to break even at best, probably lose a couple dollars a unit, but that's fine. You're making an investment into the future for when you're able to source those health and beauty products at a profit. Um, so you don't really even need to make money on these products because it's an investment in your future business. So we're going to go ahead and go over to Amazon. And the way that I would do this is I would just start copying these names and throwing them into Amazon up here and then if you find something that looks like a match then you could go ahead and buy um, something that you're gonna want to look for something that you could probably sell just so you could get a little bit of your money back um, and also is like a one pack so that you can only have to buy 10 units because Amazon requires that you buy 10 units to go ahead and get ungated um, so the two products that I found to go ahead and get, get get ungated in health and beauty are this one right here um, this seven dollar three cents uh, Jason aloe vera cream we got it over here on Amazon it's a slower seller so you'd be you'd have it for a while um, probably a month or two before it would sell maybe three um, but uh, the, we can run the profit calculator and it looks like you probably even make a tiny little profit on this so after you pay shipping and all that good stuff let's just call it 750 um, so you'd actually make a dollar on this um, you'd get your money back um, but it might take a little bit um, if you're more into getting your money back immediately, I'm um, just kind of cycling through those products. I found this one here. We've got Alba, um, whatever, Deep Clean. Uh, and then over here, we've got it for $7.37. So as you can see, there's not any profit here because it's selling for $9.80. And we're buying it for seven, basically $8. Um, so we're going to sell it for $10 and then um, buy it for $8. So you're going to be losing $240 a unit, um, but since you're only buying 10 units, you're just going to lose like $24. Um, so it's really not that bad. You're pay basically paying $24 to go ahead and get ungated in health and beauty, which is going to be a massive opportunity for you. Um, I've made, I think, almost $2,000 this last month off of just health and beauty. Um, so it's a great opportunity to go ahead and get ungated in this category. Um, so once you go ahead and all right, find these products, 
um, if these products are still in stock, uh, go ahead and add 10 units to your cart. Um, and then you're going to go ahead and check out. Um, and when you do that, so I'll just go ahead and go through this method here. We're going to go ahead and press 10 and press add to cart. So we're going to create a new cart here. Um, we're just going to do uh, video and I'm going to create this cart. So then I'm going to go ahead and go to uh, my saved carts down here. And then I'm going to go ahead and select it and then press approve. And then that would go ahead and approve it. And then from there, you're able to pay it. Um, I'm not sure if they would charge me for it if I do it here. So I'm just going to um, show you how you would do it. So you're going to press approve. And then after you pay for everything, um, you would go ahead and um, get it delivered to your house. And then you're going to get an invoice that looks a little something like this. I'm going to go ahead and pull it up on screen now. So this is the invoice that I used to go ahead and ungate for grocery. Um, I've removed some um, important info here. Um, but this is the format that I used. I can go ahead and zoom in a little bit on it. Um, we've got uh, this right here, your payer address. Make sure that this um, address that you give Frontier is your Amazon store name because Amazon is going to look for that when you go ahead and submit this invoice for ungating. Make sure that your address matches the address that is. Um, make sure, the, well, both of these addresses need to match. Um, and then make sure that your address matches the one on your Amazon seller account. And as you can see, this is actually the invoice that I used um, personally to ungate grocery. I think this was back in December. Um, and then I went ahead and circled the number of quantity just so they see that I have the quantity they're looking for. I, I think it's good to make it as easy as possible for the people who are reviewing your invoices um, to look at. Other people say don't touch it at all. Um, I've had no problems kind of editing the invoices a little bit. Um, not editing, I, I print it out and then write on it. Um, you don't want to Photoshop or anything like that. That'll get you banned in a hurry. Um, I'm just trying to write these things on it for the employees um, just so it's a little easier for them to figure out what's going on. Um, so as you can see, I also wrote down the ASIN for this specific product. So it's really easy for them to go through and say, okay, here's this product, here's the ASIN. They bought 10 of them. All right, let's go ahead and approve them. And with this specific invoice, I actually got ungated in grocery like two and a half hours after I submitted this invoice. So I think that making it easy on those employees is definitely worthwhile um, to go ahead and uh, go through that effort. One quick note about these invoices as well is that it will actually come in the box. Like you can see mine's a little folded because it was um, folded into fourths when it came in the box. There's a little bit of confusion about when you actually get the invoice. I've had people um, say, oh, they're not, they didn't send me an invoice. Well, you just need to wait for the box. Um, you're going to have to take pictures of that product anyway, which we'll go over in the next step here. Um, we will go ahead and hop over into Amazon Seller Central and I'll show you how to format everything. So once you go ahead and have that invoice and the actual product in hand, um, I just pulled up a little sample application here for something I'm not ungated in already. Um, you're going to go ahead and upload your um, invoice into this right here. You're going to check all these boxes, um, make sure that everything on your invoice is included um, on that they want to see here. And depending on the product, this one isn't asking for it here, but depending on the product, um, you might have to take pictures of the product itself. If it asks you to do that, make sure you take six pictures. Make sure you take a picture of each side. Even if it's like a circular container, just take six pictures. Um, one of each side and then one of the top and bottom and then make sure that the address so there'll be an address on um, every bottle that you purchase or every unit that you purchase there should be the address of the people who sell the product um, you're gonna want to make sure that that address is visible in the picture they want to see that address uh, I've had them kind of say hey can you take a closer picture of the address for us um, and then after that I got ungated um, but yeah so that's really as simple as it is, you're just going to press submit after you take care of all that. And then within a couple days, they should get back to you. Um, you should have no problems if you do everything um, as I just outlined here. You should have no problem getting un ungated. Even if you're a newer seller, if you're going through these channels and getting invoices and such, uh, you're usually able to get ungated in these categories. Um, but that's going to be a massive opportunity for you moving forward to go ahead and get ungated. Uh, you can also use Frontier to do other categories like grocery. Um, uh, personal, uh, what's the one, uh, personal safety and household, something like that. I ungated those both with Frontier and I sell a lot in those categories. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to drop them down below. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. That helps me out with the algorithm. Um, if you want to go ahead and check out the Facebook group, that's going to be below. Um, if you need some any new softwares, those are going to be down there as well. I can get you some coupons as well, and that helps me make more content for the channel. Uh, but that's going to do it for this video. Thanks for watching, guys.